sitting for too long on a chair at a tournament? In today's video, we're gonna cover what you can do to help yourself if you're stuck in a tournament sitting that is not optimized for your body. If you're in a tournament setting where you have to sit hunched over, maybe you have a really cramped space and your arms are kind of like <laughs> twisted, um, you know, you need to make sure that you know that the stress is going to be on your arms, that you need to counter counteract that. But th this is where preventative medicine comes in. The more flexible we are, the stronger we are, the more healthy we are, um, the more likely that, that that's going to, uh, we'll be able to weather those tough conditions. As tournament organizers, it really is your responsibility to make sure that you are cognizant of gamer health, right? If we are creating an environment for someone to be successful, you need to know its limitations as well. Sometimes it's as simple as allowing time for players to stretch, take a break, giving space enough that someone can get that stretch in. If you're able to actually kind of, uh, kind of clear your mind even for a second, and just notice where there's tension in your body. You, can, you might be able to tell like, oh man, my, my, my shoulder's actually really you know, tense right now. And then maybe you're able to kind of breathe through it and actually relax that muscle. And if possible, before the tournament even starts, ask like, do the players have room um, enough to move their arms? Do they have a space or chairs that are ergonomic where they're not going to be leaving themselves predisposed to injury just to play the great game that you're trying to host? Hopefully as the years go on, there's more attention to to the ergonomics. Um, you'll never find that in, in, in like a sporting event or, or athlete. Like you'll never find players being compromised in that in that regard. And after the tournament, like definitely plan on doing things that do not require sitting for a little bit um, and just go the full other way. We're always looking for balance, right? You can go all in on gaming, but you need to go all out every once in a while too.